Hey guys, I hope you are doing great. It's Sea of Thieves 1 year anniversary today and I'm feeling awesome. This video will be similar to the previous one, but heck, I'm gonna make it because you guys asked for it. As usual, it's the Fuzzy Guy, the Reaper's run of Shipwreck Bay. Stay tuned! In my previous Reaper's Run video, I have covered how to finish Wanderer's Refuge with efficiency, and now I will show you a similar way for Shipwreck Bay. But before I start, remember, you will not get the commendation if the voyage is voted for before Reaper flag is raised. You have to raise your Reaper flag before voting for the voyage. As usual, the voyage is made of 5 chapters. 1. Shipwreck Bay, 3 chests. Chapter 2. Crook's Hollow, Riddle. Chapter 3. Shipwreck Bay, 6 chests. Chapter 4. Snake Island, Riddle, Chapter 5, Shipwreck Bay, 9 chests, and that will be it. If you are starting from Ancient Spire or Plunder Valley Outpost, I suggest you drop one person at Crook's Hollow, with a robot, considering you are a crew of at least two, and then continue north to Shipwreck Bay. Right after you dig the three chests, the riddle at Crook's Hollow will become active. As soon as your smart crewmate is done with it, you at Shipwreck Bay will get a map with six X marks a spot. As you look for these six, he will take the rowboat and start heading towards Snake Island. It is not far and should be around the same time it takes to find the six chests and bring them back to the ship. Snake Island will activate as Chapter 4 when you finish the 6 chests. And again, when he is done with the voyage at Snake Island, you will get the final 9 chests chapter at Shipwreck Bay. Now I personally leave the two riddle chests at the riddle islands and just one tap them, since I already got 18 chests only from Shipwreck Bay. Also, the time it takes to go back and forth in the ship to bring them would be not worth the effort, but in the end, you are the captain and it's your call. Crewmate at Snake Island will take the mermaid to spawn back at Shipwreck Bay and help you out with the final 9 chests. This way you have just finished Reaper's run of Shipwreck Bay. Do that total of 5 times so you can acquire the new Shipwreck Reaper sails. As you all noticed, there is Mercenary Blunderbuss, which you can acquire by completing the Mercenary Voyage of Devil's Row, and the Mercenary Eye of Reach, which you can acquire by completing the Mercenary Voyage of Shores of Plenty. These two voyages are normal voyages that span over four islands and will get a final chapter with X marks the spot to complete. They are both similar but different regions. As for the Mercenary Pistol, in case you want to complete the set, you can just buy it from the Weaponsmith at Age Inspire for 9450 gold. No commendation unlock required, only your money. I haven't checked other outposts, let me know if it's on other ones too. As for the mercenary outfit that we all got from Friends Play Free Week, I also found them at the clothing shop in Agent Spire, but they could be in other outposts too. That is it for this video, I hope you all have a great voyage in the seas. Also, check the Discord link below and join us. Feel free to hit the like button, bell button and subscribe to get me to 1 billion subscribers. It will support me very much as my channel grows. Thank you very much, have a great anniversary.